So if you're considering my upcoming crash course collage building blocks basics workshop, that's a mouthful. If you're considering that workshop, I just wanted to uh, give a little information here about what to expect. So we're really going to be focusing on shading in collage in this workshop. And I am going to start with the most basic of simple shapes. And that's a sphere. Because believe it or not, in art, there are only five <clears throat> I think it's five, five basic shapes that all other complex shapes are created from. And they are the sphere, the cone, the cylinder, the cube. And I think that's it. So there's four. There's four. So the sphere is a circle. The cone is a triangle. The cylinder is a long tube. And the cube is the square. Um, so the building block basics, we start with a sphere, which is basically an apple, uh, so that I can teach you how to render gradual shading from the light side all the way to the dark side in very slow steps so that when you look at it, it really looks like a painting. So then in lesson two, we're going to graduate from the apple to a little bit of a more complex shape, still sort of a sphere, but a little bit more complex. We're going to use a red bell pepper. So now we have a rounded shape, but we have humps at the top and we have a stem and we have humps at the bottom where it comes to the bottom. So we'll build on everything we learned in the apple lesson to have successful shading and more volume in rendering that red bell pepper. Then we're going to move on to a flower and the flower has, um, it's a daisy, a Gerber daisy. And so all the petals are the same shape, but they're overlapping and intersecting and there's back to front layering and that gets even more complex. And we're going to go through that and focus on shading again, but then we're going to get that back to front and the layering effect more than we had with the pepper. Then the fourth lesson is going to be the small songbird because he incorporates a lot of different shapes and a lot of different textures, patterns, overlapping, and he's got little tiny feet standing on a branch. And so he is the more, the most complex of all four lessons and combinations of shapes. So once you go through these four lessons and you collage them with me, you will upload your work into the virtual classroom where your fellow students and I can give you feedback on your work and you will learn uh, skills from each lesson that will build to the next lesson. Also, there's a full module for painting collage paper. So you will also have multiple videos on how to prepare and paint your collage paper. You will have multiple video resources for how to transfer the reference photo as a sketch, how to underpaint the reference photo in preparation for collage, and then of course the collage application. I am providing the reference photos sized for each project. So all you have to do is download them and print them out. So um, we're going to have fun. We're going to learn a lot of skills. Um, it's all pre-recorded, so you get to work on it at your own pace and on your own time frame. There's one live Zoom call that is going to be me taking Q&A after all the, um, the painting paper lessons. Um, I am going to do a Q&A and a live demo for the collage application of the Apple. So I'm going to take the Apple from start to finish live with Zoom so you can ask your questions while I'm doing that. And if you're not able to attend that Zoom, I am going to record it and then put it into the modules so that it will also be available for you when you, uh, if you choose to come back and rework the workshop. The workshop is going to be available to you indefinitely on Razuku.com and it is all in one place along with all the uploads of your finished work and any questions that you have for me. Um, the course runs eight weeks. Um, I will be moderating all comments for that eight week time frame. After that time frame, you are welcome to continue working and to continue posting into the virtual classroom for feedback from your fellow classmates.
I'm also going to invite you to our private Facebook group for students so you can post your work in there. There are over 500 former paper painting students in that group. They're very active and they will answer questions and give you feedback and I'm in there once in a while as well. So I really hope that you will consider this workshop. We're going to have a lot of fun. Um, it's going to be three lessons per week for eight weeks. Uh, so it's not, uh, so it's going to be a little bit of a faster pace, but again, the projects are eight by eight and we are only doing the subject, leaving the background painted. So we have small subjects to collage, lots of big learning and um, I think we're going to have a lot of fun. And so I hope that you will consider joining me and joining us, whether you're new to collage or whether you have been doing collage and you just want to go back through some new painting paper modules from my new book, Amazing Gel Prints, and also to revisit um, techniques and tips for gradual, accurate shading. So I invite you to join us. I'm excited to see you there and I'm excited to see what you'll create. <music>